guys, welcome back. And today I will be showing you almost well almost all my fidgets because um I don't know where my other ones went. Um pretty sure I had more. But yeah, it's like early in the morning. It's seven fifty nine. So my stuffed animals are still sleeping. One, two, three, wait, one, two, three, four, five. So, yeah, um, I'll show you most of my fidgets. I keep them in, like, a backpack, because, like, I don't really, like, really have anything else to keep them in, because I don't have too, too many, so I don't really need a fidget organizer yet. So, yeah. Um, before we get into the video, make sure to like and subscribe and comment down below if you like fidgets because I know a lot of people do. So that's kind of why I'm doing this video. So yeah, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And yeah, let's get started. So guys, the first fidget toy I have, so I keep them in like this backpack thing. Then I have one, two, three, four right there. So yeah, the first thing we're going to start with is this wacky track. And we're going to be rating them on the way. I really like the wacky tracks because um, they're just really fun. You can like make different shapes with them. And um, yeah, it makes a really good clicking sound. It's really fun to play with. So yeah, I rate that a 9.5 out of 10. Next up is, I'm not going to be doing the slimes because those will get messy because I'm in my room. But here I have this homemade stress ball. It's filled with like beads. And then I have... A snake so snakes are kind of like a puzzle like I'm gonna mix it up right now and this is a mini snake by the way so so how I kind of like to do it is I try to like make it straight so I need to straighten it like that So now, what I do is I find one, two, three, four, five, six, then I twist it because then I know it's even because there are 12. So then I go like this. Then I go like this. And there you go. Now I have my snake complete. So yeah, this this is this third thing. Next I have a homemade stress ball, another one. This one it's just filled with glue and paint. And some beads. Let me try and find a bead in here. Oh here it is. Okay. So you can kind of see that white thing, that's a bead. And it's a really nice sound. So, I really like that. Next, I have these magnetic rings. I got these just yesterday. Oh, yeah, by the way, the snake is a 10 out of 10. The This is a 8.5. This is a 7.5. These are a 10 out of 10. I really, actually, no. Eight and a half, because my fingers are kind of too small. It's not the product, it's kind of my fingers, because they're too small, so when I go like this, sometimes they, like, fall off. Ah, come back here. Okay. But otherwise, I really like it. You basically just go like this, 
or like you can go like oh my gosh or you can go like this so yeah 8.5 out of 10 I'm gonna put everything that I've um, done in a pile right here next is a koosh ball um, it gets a lot, it's kind of sticky, like it gets a lot of things stuck to it, 7.5, but it's still really fun to just go like this, like, I just lost it. So yeah. Okay, so comment if you want me to do a synchronized skating video because my mom brings me so she can probably post it on her channel. She could take a video on her phone, obviously. Um, but yeah. Um, see? So, 7.5 out of 10. I think that's what I said. Next are monkey noodles. So now these have to be washed often. Like this, it has like these really shaggy things. So you can definitely not get everything out of it easy. But these you can because they're just like a big hot dog thing. So um, I rate them a 10 out of 10 because they're super stretchy. Like super duper stretchy. And I don't feel like they're going to break. So 10 out of 10. Ooh, and they come in like a ramen noodle looking box. But they're monkey noodles, not ramen noodles. Okay. Next is a mini pop tube. I rate this a 8.5 out of 10 because it's really loud. Like you can definitely not bring it in class if you're allowed to bring toys. Um, especially during like a test or anything. Because like... That is way too loud to be in class for while your teacher's talking. Monkey noodles or the rings? I think the rings would be best because, like, actually, no, they would not. Either the shaggy koosh ball or the monkey noodles because they're super quiet. You can just go like this and, like, do that. But this, definitely not. So 8.5, because it's still really nice. Next is a Rubik's Cube. This was like not really, this is not really popular anymore. But it's still like in videos, so I guess it's considered a fidget. I just don't play with it. Because first of all, I have no idea how to solve it. And by the way, I'm wearing my pajamas because it's early in the morning and I didn't get changed. And because um, I'm cold. So yeah. A fidget spinner. Fidget spinners are... Oh, yeah. 5.5 out of 10. Fidget spinners are, like, still fun. Like, you can move them on your finger. So, I rate it an 9.5 out of 10. Now... One minute. I will be right back, guys. So, guys, I was just doing something. I had to go do something real quick. But... Now I'm back, and we left off at the fidget spinner. So, next, we will be doing, um, let's see. Now we will be doing, Let's do the puzzle ball. So this isn't really a puzzle ball. Like the puzzle, normal puzzle balls are like white usually. Not always white. They can be like black or something. And you like push the colors in the same ring as the other. But this, this is like you have to match the colors to be with each other. Like blue with blue and um, like yellow with yellow and stuff like that. So... It's really fun, actually. It's kind of like a mind game, but at the same time, it's a fidget toy. So, I've seen um, Everly Rose do it. 
I mean, not do it. She had this in one of her fidget videos. But I have it too. And it's really fun. So. I love playing with this. Okay. Next is we're saving the best for last bag. You can probably tell what the last one is, but. Okay. Then we have simple dimples. Now I have four simple dimples. It was supposed to come only these two. Um, and this one broke. I was on the ice and I fell and I didn't get hurt by the way. And I landed on my hand and it broke. So that and it was the day after I got it. So not really exciting for it to break, but they're still really nice. So, I rate these, oh yeah, I rate this a 10 out of 10. I rate these a 10 out of 10 because they're super portable and you can like bring them into class and you can just like, and they're not too loud. So, you can hang it on your backpack. I had it on my backpack. You can hang it, hang it on your jeans like for the belt loop or where it's supposed to be. But, yeah. I'll just show you, like, my slimes. I won't actually open them. Okay, and this one. I have a pea popper. Now, my friend broke this, but that's okay, because it was kind of already broken, because the middle part came out. Sorry about the quality. It's usually not like this, hopefully, to you guys. Um, it's just the lighting in here. I only have one light on right now. And the one in my closet, it broke, so. Then I have a mini fidget spinner. This is like a 7.5 because they have like these little things here. I don't know if you can see it. But they have like this thing here. It's really spiky and it kind of hurts me if I go really hard. Like, ow, that actually hurt. But I rate it. I rate this as... 6.5 so guys these are all the fidgets we've gone through so far so we will keep going until we have finished them all next I have a mochi mochis are really cute and they're so tiny and like they're sticky I kind of like the stickiness for some reason comment if you like it too if you've ever felt a mochi but um yeah. One minute. So guys, I'm back. And next I have this slime. 8.5. The glitters make it harder to stretch. Now this one is a 10 out of 10. It's a class slime and it's super duper stretchy. And I just really like it. You can kind of see it here. Which I'm trying to get, I'm going to get a new bag for it because it's really broken right now. So I'm like folding it like saran wrap. I still have this slime. This one I can take out because it's like not stretchy at all. I give it a 1 out of 10. Look, it's breaking. You can clearly see that it's breaking and it's super hard to stretch. So this is a 1 out of 10. Then I have this. I can't take it out because the container is too hard, but this is sensory putty. Um, Crazy Aaron's thinking putty. And it's mystifying mermaid. It turns from this color to this color. So this is a 10 out of 10. Now this is silly putty. Um, it's kind of like not really stretchy. Um... I don't really like it. I give it a 5 out of 10 because, like, I know it's, like, silly putty. It's not, like, slime or anything. Like, this slime. It was terrible. I do not recommend to get this. Glitter putty. Do not get that. Because it's not even putty. It's, like, broken down slime. Okay. 
but I'm still really happy, and, um, I'm really happy that I got that. Well, I got all of these Witcher toys, so. There we go. Now, last, guys, moment you've all been waiting for. Hopefully, you've been waiting for this part, and you did not end the video. If you didn't end the video, um, good for you. Thank you. We have poppets. Okay, I love poppets. This is my no. So I'm gonna go from favorite to least favorite. I don't know, but I don't really have any least favorites. These are my last favorites. This one kind of like pops up when I do the hard side and the quiet side. See, some of them you might see pop back up. One just popped back up. So that's the downside about it, but the loud side. So I rate all these 10 out of 10. This one, um, it's like more flimsy. It's probably like... The flimsiest one here. This is really nice because it's like loud on both sides. Now, here's the loud side. Now this one, it's one of my favorites. It's the same as the rainbow one. It has like a no quiet side, kind of. The loud side. They still sound really good. Like if you hadn't heard the loud side yet, you could probably not tell which one. Now this one is kind of hard to press on the quiet side. Like, it's really like hard. But then the loud side. You can really go like this. It's really fun. So guys, I hope you I hope you liked this video. Like again, um, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Wait. So guys, hold on. I want to show you all my fidgets right here. These are all the ones we went through right now. Um, I'm pretty sure I have more, like a lot more. Oh yeah, I also have this like textured thing. I forgot I had this, but it's like a textured thing. This is actually a fidget. I just, I don't know how my fidget, fidgets get all across my room. But then there's like this thing on the back. You can like... That's fun. So guys, I hope you like this video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't yet. And I'll see you next time. Bye!